Hey everybody, Lady Spirit 78 here. And Christian Cosplayer and here this too. Is the first recording of the new year. It is now 2011. Yeah, actually at like 2 in the morning. So happy new year to you guys, even though it's probably very late in January or maybe even February by the time you see it. Happy old year! Actually, no, it'll probably be about mid January when you see this. And thus, as a new year's, as a very belated new year's gift to you guys, we are going to go to Neverland! Yep, it's been about one hour into the new year here, so let's go to Neverland. Woo! Where we never grow old. <laughs> Boy, we could use that on this holiday. <laughs> yeah. It's like, it's like um, 12.59 on, or I'm sorry, 11.59 on New Year's Eve, and it's like, you know, I really want it to be 2010 for the rest of my life. <laughs> to Neverland! Or maybe, oh, I don't know, somewhere in the 90s. That would, that would work, too. I liked well, being a child. As did I. But anyway. Leave him to me. Oh. Oh boy. Man in a suit. All right. All right. Let's get this. Oh, bleh, bleh, I can't talk. Let's get this going. Really? And again, we're not using hyperdrive because it's a terrible keyblade. It is. X. Oh, we missed! Crap. Uh, off screen, we did a few things to our decks. Um, we have now have Turaga, Brutal Blast, Byraga, which means we will be getting, um, whatchamacallit soon. Oh. That did nothing. Curses. We will be getting, um, Crawling Fire soon, and then we will be getting, uh, uh, what's it called? Um. Mega Flare. Durr. Whatever it's called. Ow! That hurt. We also should be getting another finish command, hopefully soon. It depends basically on the number of steps we take, I believe. And I believe we still have to take about 4,000 Ah, uh, he walked away! Ow! You hurt uh, me! At least, uh, as you can see, the enemies are flashing by right now, as usual. So you guys can see the names of the enemies? Well, I can't, because I don't remember these enemy names. Triple Wreckers. Okay, thank you. Ow. Big got a boo boo. Big boo boo. Big on burst. Let's go. Max power. So long. Maximum. Maximum power. Mostly I want the big wild bruiser to die. Because he is the most. Oh, uh, gigantic gorillas are obnoxious, square. Oh, crap. Alright, there we go. There's Kiraga at work. Gotta love it. Alright, let's. Did a button even come up? I didn't even see a button come up. That's because, you, we, that's because we were locked onto an, to an airborne enemy. Oh. We couldn't uh fail. Oh well. Square! Ah. Freaking arch ravens! They'll be the death of us! Don't you say a word. Ha! Broken birdie! Die. Ha. Ooh, mind square leveled up. Yeah, we put in mind square off screen, which would actually be a pretty good idea to use now. We'll shoot off. I have a feeling the rock is probably going to take a lot of the free rock. Huh. Uh, you got a point. Uh, did it do anything? Okay, there we go. I mostly did it to that guy over there. X! There you go! Um, yeah, I think it would be actually a good idea to heal and then use Mind Square. Maybe not directly on top of you, but let's get over there and just use it. Is this Mind Square? That's Brutal Blast, actually, but that wouldn't be bad either. Go up. Okay, there you go. Okay, use it right about there. You yep. can't get... Didn't do anything to them. Why did they barely take any... Hey, wait, wait. Come on. Why did Come they for me. Any damage? That's not coming. That did not hurt. Fire. What did I just do? Why I'll am I... use fire, but... Uh, heal. Heal. heal and use um, Thundar. Thundaga. Thunder. Okay, apparently they're immune to that. Lovely. Burn the monkey! 
We're being very brutal to monkeys right now. Actually, We're being... perhaps they're apes. Simians, at least. Indeed. I couldn't tell if they had a tail or not. Bombastic Simian. That should be the name of a heartless. That would be a cool name for yeah, heartless. Bombastic, the, the bombastic best. simian, a little monkey heartless that rides in like uh the like uh a Some basket. Kind of bomber. What? Some kind of if bomber. I, your assistance, I'd have it. We <laughs> I love that. If I would have if I would have wanted your oh, assistance, yes, I would have demanded it. You we did demand it. Those things to the biscuit. We would. Why I'd have given him a little of this and this. Yeah, you don't frighten no one's me. Don't me you'll get a share of me treasure, understand? I'm not after your precious box, Captain. I'm looking precious for a box. A boy. He's got a box of money. He's got a box of money. Any but anyways, um what was it? But no, the bombastic simi like riding in a little basket on top of a giant elephant heartless called the Tusk Crusher. Oh, that'd be cool. And the monkey throws bombs instead of Yep, yep. Oh. Hey, hold on. What did you just say about the light? And again, he's associating with ah, the yes, villains! Heartbreaking, really. This chest, you see, contains light gathered from all around. And I've got an acquaintance, a boy, who's sure to try and seize it. Hmm. A boy who's after the light. If it's not Benitas, then who? Hey, why don't I help you keep the light safe? Oh dear, are we gonna have to lug that treasure chest around the entire time here? I don't think so. Pan. Blast you, Peter Pan! Neverland! Wow. In a way, it's kind of the next to the last world again. Wow. I mean, like, End of the World and uh, Final Mix was the last world, and so Hollow Bash was the next to the last, but I mean, nothing really happened in End of the World except the final boss battle. Exactly. So, kind of, this is, and I mean, we gotta go back to, we gotta go back to another world to have another big boss battle before exactly. we go to the final world. So, technically, the Neverland is the, is, is again, the second to, the next second to last world. Do I go this way? Yep, go that way. <laughs> Alright. So, we are here in Neverland, and that was actually <coughs> As you can see, Neverland got a huge makeup from the days of Kingdom Hearts 1. Actually... It's no longer taken on a ship, it is actually Neverland itself. Actually, technically, when you say that, you're kind of wrong. Oh? No, oh, you mean like the... It, it didn't get a makeover from Kingdom Hearts 1. It, Kingdom Hearts 1 got a make... It... Kingdom Hearts 1 never really technically took place in Neverland. Yeah, it took place on Captain Hook's ship, and why am I saving? Eh, just save. I didn't mean to do that, people. La la la. I guess never really heard, so if the file gets corrupt, then I'll just stick something in there for the walls. The data is scuffled. I'll probably stick that in there. Anyway, hi potion! The data is all scuffled. Do I go this way? Yep. La, 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 la. Uh, so let's see, what do we have to get here in Neverland, actually? I don't remember. Oh, look! Peter Pan's hideout. Aww. Oh, I really can't go in. I... cute. Monkeys! Giant evil okay. monkeys. Okay! Sound like a rogue chicken. <laughs> rogue chipmunk, did you say? I said chicken. The way I said, monkey! <laughs> Ooh, we went dark haze and geo impact. If you can get somewhere around here. We can also get our Solum, which is a very good move for Terra. Where? That's what I gotta find out. Dark Haze and Geo Impact we can get from the Mermaid Lagoon. Ow. And our and our Solum we can get from Skull Rock. Cavern. Mm, we'd have to come back after the boss battle then. Indeed. Well, we will do that, because those are some really good moves. The Dark Haze we basically need so we can get, um, that Dark Sonic Blade thing. Chaos Blade, I believe it's called. We'll probably be doing a lot of stuff off screen before the final fight. Or at least you will, because I'll be leaving soon. True. And you die! I don't plan on doing anything tonight. It's about 1.23 in the morning on New Year's Day, so... Hi, where's the other monkey? Oh, there's a treasure chest. Not a monkey, yeah. but a treasure chest. 
Funny thing is, we'll be seeing each other about 12 hours again tomorrow, so like 12 hours from now, so we're taking a short mini. What hiatus. happened? Oh crap! Um, should I just deal it something? That was actually really close. That's kind of funny. Ven never did get his level up all this time. Come on! I'm trying to get around the monkey's butt. Get the monkey! 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 Die! Oh my gosh, Tara, you are moving. Woo! He dropped something. He dropped it. He dropped it. Get the thing. Yay! Woo! Ben is now officially leveled up. Ben is now fish fully leveled up? He is. He looks like a fish. <laughs> Actually, nah. He looks more like a jackal. I believe the suits are based off jackals. Oh, gosh, my leg. I cannot take this train on my leg. Is this the Mermaid Lagoon? I think. Okay, Why do you leg. ask? We're gonna be on need on the lookout for some pretty really good news. And we leveled up! Woo! Level 23! And I leveled that's, up. Uh, I think that's actually kind of where we want to be. I would actually recommend being at least 35 for the final boss. I suppose that's pretty decent. The final area gives you level ups like crazy if you take advantage of them. Yeah. The final area is just crazy in and of itself. No, no, no. It's gonna. It jumped into the water. I hate when I do that. Don't you though? Why does it like committing suicide? <laughs> it just jumped into the water again! For no reason! Ow. Run! You aren't going to commit suicide. Er, wow, I have he, to admit, I really like the Neverland music. They do Special well. music, anyway. I know our music's alright. That our music's really fun. As you can tell, there's some cosplayers the ones playing at the moment, but I will be taking care of some of the bosses. Yes, yes, you heard me right. Some. Mainly, he's taking over now because, more or less, when we get to the end game, it'll probably be all me. And by end game, I mean Terra's end game. We still got a far way to go, people. Quite a ways to go. Right. Thunder. Thunder. Why is he immune to that? I don't see. I don't want him. I actually work pretty well. I just want to kill it before it falls into the water. No, I know. I, that actually worked out pretty well. I'm not okay, sure. Okay, Dark Haze is around here somewhere. It's somewhere across the water. Across the water? Uh-huh. In fact, it looks like it's probably over there. Uh, no, not there. Go the other way. Like, to the right. After you kill these guys, I mean. I want to kill them. Because they are not nice. So free, so free. That one's gonna fall in the water, just giving you a heads up. Yep. And he's right there! Hi! He's also gonna fall in the water again. <laughs> you may wanna... <laughs> you may wanna, um, um, hit him with, uh, something else. Like, I'll just wait till he comes my way again. Him. See? Now you just gotta come my way, little buddy. Come on, follow the pretty key. All right, we gotta glide all the, or actually not glide, but we gotta air, whatever, all the way over there. No, 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 not that way. Uh, actually, wait, can we swim there? Hey, look, we can. And here we get. That's not what I thought it was gonna be, actually. Well, cause I know that this is the right way to go to get to the next boss battle. Yeah, this is definitely the right way to go. Okay. Let's just wipe these guys off the face of the earth and get a Fyraga level up. After this, let's see if Fyraga's leveled up to its highest. 
And then let's melt it with a slow to get crawling by flame and then we work our way on that so we can get on Mega Flare. In fact, let's take a look at our take a look at our stuff here. Hang on. Triangle. We broke rock. That's rock breaker. Where? I must beat up the monkey. Oh, I missed. Hello, map. At least I'm going to assume that's the map, but let's take care of these guys first just so we don't get an overrun of enemies if we're wrong. Hmm. Not again, Pack. Level up. Okay. Yeah, that's one thing I've always found interesting about this game is that everything levels up. It's a good thing you check that after beating up the monkey. It's that everything levels up. It's a pretty interesting concept. Look at all the money I got! Open sesame! Ooh, Pyroga! Now where do we go? Uh, go up. Go up. Glide over there. I can't glide. No, 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 not that way. Ah. And we get Mega Potion. Alright, get to that palm tree. No, don't walk off. Okay. Get to the palm tree. What palm tree? That palm tree. Palm tree to your right. Palm tree. What? Oh, I have to jump onto that? Yeah. Glide. And then goes to the hole. Oh my gosh, I didn't know you could do this. Yes, yeah, how you get Geo Impact. <laughs> Switch out there's enemies up here. You may want to be quick about them. You're done. I believe it's where we get Geo Impact. If it is, I'm going to be royally concussed. Hmm. Alright, that takes care of him. And we get. Ah, crap! He died. Just unlock on. Just let him go. And then we get Geo Impact. Alright, um, let's figure out where Dark Haze is from up here. Wait, maybe you can? I think you can land on the. Maybe! No, you can't, no, you can't, no, you can't! Ah, you can't land on anything! Well, too late now. And in the water we fell. Well, maybe maybe we don't need Dark Haze. Our Solon will be nice enough. Exactly. Chaos Blade, we can get with another Dark Level up to man. Um, I just can't lightning. give you, uh, what? How are you gonna get out of the water? No, my friend, I was actually wondering that same thing. Actually, <sighs> wait. Hey. This is where it's located! Dark Haze! Wow! That's that was a cheap move. Okay, that rock. Go to... No, not that rock. Other rock. Other rock is another rock. Yes, that rock. Rock and roll! Right. No, don't fight him. Goodbye. Ah, crap. You are just... Uh, lightning. I'm sorry, but it must die. Ooh, that was neat. No, don't fall off. Got the point. Ooh, we only need 84 to another level up. Oh my gosh, you're in Rock Breaker. Nice. Let's kill these guys and get Rock Breaker power. No! Not in the water! Failure. In the water. Gurgle, gurgle, squirgle. <laughs> <laughs> I'm having trouble not dying right to now. Yeah, no, no! Lightning, you idiot! <laughs> oh, no, okay, screw it. Let's just get the points and get out of here. Don't fall in the water! Got them. I don't know. Nope. Come on.
Yeah, we're lost. We don't know where to go. Ah. I'm trying to follow the keyblade, but the keyblade's just going in circles. Oh god. Anyway. Ah, well, dizzy. at least we got all those treasures out of the way that we needed. Uh, what you guys probably saw was just us cutting to them and some epic fails that happened on the way. Yes, now epic fails. I'm going to show you what happens when you go through the story the normal way. Because we keep failing. Bum. Ba -da -dum -bum -ba -da 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 -da. Ironically, this uh, is actually a different day, recording wise, but it's still the same episode. Kind of funny. No, it's the same day. Oh, well, yeah, technically. Technically, it's the same day, just many, many hours later. Alright, let's Death. get rid of these things. You <laughs> fell! You ah, fell! Ow! I'm going to hit oh, you yes, now. Oh yes, and we uh, messed around with some of our finish commands to get some better ones. Ah, Jelly finish. Shades, what are you doing here? And we put finish back on so we can go and get Rising Rock, which in turn we can get Rising Rock 2 hopefully before the final boss, which I kind of doubt, but who knows. If we could at least get Rising Rock before the final boss, that'd be great. Is that it? Is that all of you? Good. It looks like it. Hi, Potion! Hi, Potion! Hello. To be honest, I really don't think we did much else. We didn't really level up much, because we were in a pretty decent spot. In all honesty. Yeah, we are. This is decent. Oh. Uh. constantly. Okay, we may now. Nope. You're done. It and is boom, a virtual... Boom, 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 boom. I always hate those things. Those tri these triple wreckers are pointless. I like them though because they use the powers of lightning, ice, and fire. No! Serve not the harmony of fire, ice, and lightning! And it's rocks! not earth. Yeah, you definitely don't want to get earth ticked off because he will hit you with a keyblade. So Boom. DEATH! And we're actually going through levels pretty quickly, in all honesty. My rocks. <laughs> Monkey! I actually think there may be a treasure chest behind that rock. It was pretty it was placed in a pretty obscure angle. Well yeah, you things. Take that. Oh crap. That did nothing. No, that did absolutely nothing. Alright, let's just walk on through. Didn't you say there that there no, was No, I was wrong, I saw it and it was open. And that's a spider chest. Are you sure? There's no such thing as ah! I warned you. I told as, her. As you can tell, hey, I told you. No, he, no, no. There's a, isn't there a quote from that so Raven? I told her. Told her twice. I think I don't remember. Anyway. Head on through. Woo! Christian cosplayer, me. It's playing. I'm going to start ooh, talking in the third. Here. I'm going to start talking in the third I think person now. there's something now. in here that we want. We want our stolen. That's somewhere in this cavern. Ah, uh, no, that's at Skull Rock. Oh, uh, this is in the entrance. We're in the Skull Rock entrance, aren't we? Yeah. Okay, well, what's in the cavern? So we'll probably be coming back for that, actually. Yeah, because the cavern is where well, we, we have to definitely want our stolen for Terra. It's actually also a pretty good move for Ven as well, I believe. What's over here? Okay, Absolutely nothing. Absolutely nothing. Good thing Terra doesn't have, like, some kind of air command. Like, you know, like, uh, basically if you don't get out of the water by a certain amount of time, he drowns. Like most games, like, uh, Wind Waker or, or um, Sunshine, which is kind of ironic. Well, he's swimming. He, Tara can swim. It's not like he's... No, I know, but they swim too, but then if they run out of air, they drown. Look, look what happens when Tara is in water. No, I know, he's swimming. But see, his head is above the water. You want to know what the sad thing is? What? In Wind Waker, Link's head is above water. He can still drown. I will show you later. Anyway. What idiot made that? I guess they made that so that you can't theoretically swim all the way across the world. Because the entire uh, area is made out of water. Like, almost the entirety of the land is made out of water. So crossover? Shall we do I a... say we cross over. Shall we, shall we do a crossover? Indeed. Eh, crossovers used to be funny, now they're just stupid. Yeah. Alright, I think this might be the cavern. Maybe. 
No, this is the end. No, 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 this isn't. Okay, here we can get a chip sticker and a pancea. A chippy sticker? Oh, no, I didn't mean Oh, well. Oh, yeah, we can also buy some prize pods here, but we don't really need any of them. We don't really need anything that was here, so. There you go, Lightning. It's your turn. Grazie. I look forward to doing this. Grazie, did you say? Grazie. It's Italian for thank you. It is Italian. We are now playing a Mario. It's a me, a Luigi. I attack with my hands. I attack with my hands. And my Mario RPG air. The Mario guys, he doing? Shooting stars. <laughs> you just see a little Luma with a gun, a shooting star. <laughs> This one, it, it kept on sparkling and shining even after it crashed down. Why, what if it's real? Mm, yes, yeah, Christian cosplayer is dying of cough. No. Death! Idiot! Why didn't you tell me? He just did your idiot. I'm surrounded by idiots! <laughs> I use that phrase frequently, especially at school. Step away. Mm. I trust you can see to things till I return. Sure. If any of my school friends are watching, you are not one of them. <laughs> no, I save. <laughs> I know! I, I'm, I'm good with those kind of saves! I'm also good with save points. At least you don't oh, introduce oh. them in a corny way. Go Kitty boy! It's so bad if they go Kitties! Like he's found himself a new and he's quite annoying! And I don't like him. I don't like him a bit. Men, you move in and nab the treasure. Are you Peter Pan? That's me. Oh. The light is not yours to take. All right, I get to beat up on Peter Pan, who is Go actually get him, boy! here. Remember how annoying he was in KH1, even though he was somewhat nice in the end. Well, now we get a little payback. Yeah, we. <laughs> and also, who's yeah, the who's Peter the guy who's the guy at the beginning of Ocarina of Time that Mido. we said? Mido. Mido. Well, I call is... Pepto Bismol. Yep. Ooh, we're really going all out here. Butt mash! As you can tell, Peter Pan's not my favorite Disney person. He's he reminds me of Mido, and I don't like Mido. Mido's a jerk. Fire. You that hit was me. not no! Nope, get out of here. Dude! Would you stop flying? Got him now. Yep, this should take him. Like seriously, I think you only have to take the- yep. Yep, you only have to get him down just a tiny bit. Yep, you only have to do half health. I got revenge on the Kokiri, boy! Yes! The Kokiri is dead! Take mm. down Peter Pan, Mido, man, Pepto, Bismol. What do you want with the light? Light? What light? <laughs> oh wow, we, we said that at the dead. like same time. Weird no, voice acting. Yet, you blockheads. Hey. <laughs> blockheads! <laughs> These kids sound so weird. Yeah, especially the guy who looks like a bear. That hurt. Oh, sorry. Whoa! <laughs> he sounds like a, an old this? car horn or something. He sounds like a whale. Oh. 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 You know, the usual stuff. He sounds I've like the mating call of the whale. Sounds like you've been tricked. Ooh. I'll say. Ah, Kokiri boy. I owe you we finally got to beat up on the Kokiri. The oh, it was all in good fun. It's it's always yeah, nice to beat up on it's Mido it's because it's he's a jerk. What's your name anyway? You can get through with it, assured. And she. Right then, Tara. Maybe. Which way did go? They said something about a shooting star. Sorry. Shooting star. <laughs> Tinkerbell must be in with a gun! Men, guard that treasure with your lives! But it's all over the floor! You go and get him, Pan! Well, I should be on my way. <laughs> well, that was a pretty simple boss. Ah! Oh! Whoa, we forged a D-Link! You look like Peter Pan, apparently. Alright. Wow, I can't believe... I mean, think about it. I mean, like, if... We we meet the guy for like five seconds and all of a sudden we can forge a D link with him. Exactly, it's kind of funny. <laughs> it's just like. Ha! Huh. All right, this is where we can get some pre treasures. Oh. All right, where are they? Wait. Oh, screw with me. Our solemn is in this room. Where is it now? Maybe they appear after. 
Uh, are you sure it's in? Yeah. Th is is the room that our solom is in? Is this is it shaped like that? Indeed it is. Oh, but it's on a higher level. Wait, there's a room that you need to get to it from. We're gonna have to come back here. Yep. You gotta get to it from a higher area. As I'm looking at the map here, there's like three different exits you can come in, and we need to go to the one on the far right. Yep, skull rock. Gigantic skull. What happened to the rest of the body? That's what I want to know. What happened to the rest of the body of the rock monster? <laughs> rock monster! Maybe we found it. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, I wonder if we could actually go in there now. Hey, jelly shades! How much experience does this guy give you? That was what, 764? Uh, they give you not much. It's kinda sad. Whoa, there's more of them. Hey, uh, they're making weird sounds. Seriously, did you hear that? That was quite a weird sound. Uh, that was a weird sound, I will give you that. Well, there's something right there. I think that's the, yep, Pensia. Panacea. Where's, um... That's one Where is the chip sticker? Uh, it's on the other side, but we don't need it. Boom. ba da dum bum 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 Alright, let's go. Alright, I am controlling this time. I gave Lightning the controls because she loves to beat up on Kokiri boys. Indeed. But now you're back in control to take care of the... Massive Army of, of Jelly Shades! shades. Can't we just let them eat the kids? Uh, I guess we gotta be nice. What was with the unversed with the treasure chest? Oh, just these like... things only give you five experience. That's pathetic. But when you're beating up a crowd of them... They're going to give you a lot more. Best thing to do here would be just to mash them or you shoot off. But don't get anywhere near them. Because if you get too close, they will basically combo you into submission. I've died on this before. Don't take their small amounts of HP. And I've died on them lightly. too. They're definitely not that easy. You're done. So Wee, I don't like really think they killed it that many. Alright, now I can get in there. Just watch out or you'll get swarmed. Like that. Almost. Good thing I used to finish it. These guys I believe aren't that these hard. things only have like one HP. Yeah, they're not that hard. In fact, you could ow. Yeah, see how much damage they do? These guys have very high attack. To make up for basically everything else that they lack in. Come on, die! Yeah, get out there and use a shoe off. You got enough for another 30. Oh yeah, I could also plow through them with that. I never thought of that before. Oh, my Sonic, um, whatchamacallit? See, that's how you almost get combos. Not fun, my friends, not fun. Alright, let's see. That one's chasing you down. You son of a I need my cure back. I need my cure. Cure. Alright, there you go. Do what you will. Do you actually have to kill every single one of these? Oh, we got Rising Rock. Apparently not. We got Rising Rock. Cool. That is our next finisher, which we really, really want. I wanted Twisted Hours, but Lightning wouldn't listen. Uh, the reason I said no to Twisted Hours is because Boy, they go in succession, sure more or less. It's basically like going up a ladder, and if you want to go up the ladder, you need Rising Rock, Rising Rock 2, Ahoy, and a bunch of other stuff. Twisted Ooh. Hours went down on a ladder, Go sadly. <laughs> That's great. All's well. <laughs> Go hide. He sounds so serious when he says that. Go hide. What's Go that? hide before the man Tinker with the car murders you. Peter Pan's dearest friends. Smash the lantern, Terra! Smash it! Can I have a look? -see? Yeah, I want to see. As I have his precious pixie, Pan's demise is all but assured. <laughs> oh! Get ready to meet your maker, Hook! What's the meaning of this? 
You know, I didn't give it that much thought. Just doing what my heart tells me. It's there you go, Tara! There you go! That's the right thing to- Oh, somebody's in trouble! Rup row. It's the crocodile who took my hand! He's after my other hand! This kid sounds so weird. The, yeah, I... I... Yeah, frankly, the Lost Boys just sound weird in this game. Now, this is pretty music again. The funny thing is, is that when... Like, when we first heard the first few English voice actors for this, they said that Tinkerbell was going to be voiced by Mae Whitman, the, the woman who normally voices Tinkerbell in all of her speaking yeah, appearances. Tinkerbell doesn't speak once in this game. Which I suppose that maybe they yeah. just wanted to keep classic Tinkerbell. Yep. Hard to believe there are so many mm. worlds out there yeah. besides our own. The light is their hearts. And it's shining down on us like a million lanterns. Oh. What? Words of wisdom. Many uh, nuggets of wisdom in this game. What oh. does that mean? Hey. You'll find out someday, I'm sure. I wanna know now. Wow, you're a whiny little thing, aren't you? <laughs> And they all laugh about it, for no apparent reason. <laughs> yeah. Happy memories from the premiere. Yep. Back when we were still sane. <laughs> it's worth it just to listen to this music, because this music is pretty. So much for the pirate treasures. Okay, would you shut up? Did you guys really want the jewels and gold <laughs> that badly? So weird. There... Yeah, no, I don't... I don't care about that stuff. I mean, he sounds like a normal kid, but the guy in the bear suit does not sound right. I'll tell you what. Put the stuff that's really special to you in there. That can be your treasure. Yeah! How many you nuggets of wisdom idea. can they put into one game? I have no idea. I it's like a know. meal of wisdom nuggets. Kind of makes me wonder what I'd put in there. <laughs> Try and stuff Ven and Aqua into a, the treasure <laughs> chest. <laughs> Get inside the box! Does this do anything for us? No, nah, it's completely worthless and we'll be outshined by a better keyblade in about five minutes. <laughs> five minutes. Yeah, right. Ha, 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 him. Yeah, ha, ha, ha. Actually, no, we get the keyblade before him. Oh, we do? Yep, we get it in this episode. Hopefully. Oh, flying through space. The light! No, Tara! Don't go toward the light! It's so warm. Mm, warm and cozy. Soft, warm, and cuddly. Much like a teddy bear. Only not. Whoa! Trippy. We know this place. This is Destiny Islands! Oh, hello. Oh, gosh. Please, please tell me Tita, Selfie, and Waka aren't here. Please tell me they're not here. Oh, hey, look, it's a Palpu. What are. What is Somewhere it doing? There, there's this tree with star shaped fruit. Oh, the prophecy comes through! The tree with star shaped fruit. Oh, the that Palpu fruit! The world she was talking about was definitely Destiny Islands. So if we're on Destiny Islands, then... I wonder... Who else is here? Hmm... Aqua... Vin... Where are you, Terra? I, wonder if I think he's in the shack. Again. Oh, inside the shack, okay. Like all the and he's going up and together. then walking... On the ramp. Just yeah. push us further away. To the tree. I think he was in that shack. Now the light has led me here. So I actually what wondered what's at the door do? opening anyway, but then when I thought about it, I'm like, maybe he's in that shack. In the shack that had the save point. Yeah, see, he just came out of it. But it was like entirely dark in there. I'm sure they wanted to make it somewhat symbolic. Hey, slow down. Could you just wait for me? <gasps> Keep it up already. They're so cute. And there they are, the heroes of the Kingdom Hearts series, Sora and Riku themselves, but as little children. 
I don't know. I say Terravet and Aqua are bigger heroes. No, I know, but the main heroes that we've known for years. Were you brought here to meet the boy? Yeah, definitely to meet Sora. Oh, ahoy! We're over here. Riku, race ya! First one to the boat gets to be captain. <laughs> Come on! You call that running? They're so cute! You are slightly adorable. No. Yes. <laughs> they are! Just look at little Sora run! Sora. Random dude. <laughs> cool. Riku. Random, Random dude. Random dude. I'm gonna go say hi. <laughs> Did you come from the outside world? Huh? Why would you say that? Because Stara. Um, um, well, um, um, well, actually, um. So how about you? Yeah. What are you doing here? About that. <laughs> Tara just openly admits this. Uh, cover's been blown. May as well not hide any more secrets. My cover's blown. That that ends that. Left for good. Who? Who is that? And why does he look like Tara? Who is that? Who? Whoa! Grown up Riku. That is the Kingdom Hearts 2 well, design for Riku. Anyway? Not exactly sure what that prophesizes. Is there? I mean, I think it's basically been told world? that the man that. Uh, Riku yeah. turned into first was young Xehanort, but mm -hmm. like who, who apparently was a native of Destiny Islands, the apparently, world. but then he left. But he's really strong. The funny thing is, like when Terra finds the Papu fruit in the water, it's just like it washes up on the shore. I know. <laughs> Riku didn't have to do all the work to get it this time, to the that <laughs> and it wasn't easy to get. <laughs> you know, like my friends. Oh, you make so many references to that. Outside this tiny world is a much bigger one. So this is where Riku got the idea for outside worlds. Makes sense. What are you... Do we still have the normal Keyblade on? Key. Nope. So long as you have the making... This must have been like a pre-rendered scene, because in most scenes they, al they always have the Keyblade you were wielding. And you will find me, friend. No ocean will contain you then. No more borders around or below or above. So long as you champion the ones you love. It's a rhyme! And that, my friends, is a technique known as the Keyblade Transference uh, uh, technique, I believe. I think it's called the Keyblade Inheritance Ceremony. Okay. The KIC. It it's a kick! You gotta keep this a secret. Keyblade right? inheritance ceremony. Otherwise, all the magic will wear off. So that's what how magic. He... So that's how why Riku was supposed to be the chosen one of the Keyblade, but when he turned to darkness and forgot hey, to champion the ones he loved, it went to Sora. Uh, you know. Yep. No, what? That's basically what happened why from Kingdom Hearts me? One. Mm -hmm. Who was that guy? Somebody you know? Maybe. Oh, there you go again. Just tell me. I really can't. See, that's kind of how I was as a little child. I was like Sora. I was kind of like, oh, come on. I don't want to. I want to know all of your secrets. That's what I was like as a child. I was like. Protect the things that matter. Right. My friends matter to But me. yeah, it's just like. I mean, does Riku. Is this like a habit of Riku's walking up to random strangers? That would be my guess. And there it is, probably one of the best Keyblades for Terra. Not the best, but one of the best. Ends, Ends of the, the Earth. Earth. Which looks like, um, just a powered up version of his original Keyblade. Indeed, which we will be using now. Ends of the Earth? Yep. If we can ever get a menu. Ben. What? That light. Is it Ben? I think. Doesn't it kind of look like Ven? Find me. Kind of looks like Ven. You know, the little, the <laughs> the little point of light kind of looks like Ven, doesn't it? Mm-hmm. Oh, 
Okay, we're not following Ben. We're going to go see Mr. Old Man. Who has no candy. I'm still waiting for candy from him. Oh, I ordered okay. it like three weeks ago. Actually, by this point, like two months ago. All right, well, hopefully we can now take a break here and end off the episode while we switch in. Unlock the command board. Oh, weird. Well, we uh, basically have to uh, fix our decks a little bit here. So and now, episode... my friends, the map for Kingdom Hearts Birth by Sleep is complete. For Terra, anyway. We've got all the worlds here. So, in the next episode, guys, we will head back to the Badlands. And we will basically see Master Xehanort and stuff will go down. Stuff will go down? So, while off screen we're going to fix our deck a little bit. I don't know whether we're going to level up or not. I don't know. Uh, we will uh, switch on that new keyblade that we got and do a bunch of other stuff. So, so see you guys next episode. Next episode where we will... The plot will thicken... And Indeed. everything will be coming to a close for Indeed. Terra. And please excuse the time. We accidentally left the game on all night last night. And we also left the game on all day on Halloween. So that filled up probably a good 15 hours on our Yeah, time. we're not we're not very smart. So it's not. it hasn't actually taken us 28 hours to get here. It's probably taken us like around 12. Yeah. So, all right. All right. See you next time. Bye, guys. Bye.